Tito, sure. Okay, boy. Much, much. Um, you. The last time we spoke to you, it was when you were, you know, still getting your feet at Pirates, but you've suddenly become one of those players that people identify as their star. Um, how has it been, man? Looking at where you're going now into the final of the MTN Eight. Um, I think everything was going very well, but in the past, um, I think four games we haven't won any game, and it, I think it's a pressure for the team, for everyone in the team. But I think we have a great opportunity to bounce back um, coming to this MTN final. So we want to do well, we want to start very well, and I think we have to forget about what happened in the past because we can't control the past, but we have an opportunity to make history and we want to um, defend the cup and we want to win the cup as well. What, what could have been the stumbling block for you guys looking at how you've been performing, building up to this, but all of a sudden four games without a positive result for you? Yeah, I think we perform very well in most of our games and I think the lack of scoring goals in these past games have cost us um, points also and also uh, the continuity into our other tournaments as well. But I think we doing very well, but we just have to make sure that we win the games and we score goals um, to make sure that our friends, um, our loved ones are very happy with us because at the moment it's uh, very tough for us, but it's a... Uh, a great opportunity to bounce back, especially in the cup, to make sure that we make everyone happy. So we want to fight for the trophy and we want to do well also. So coming up against Sundowns, Patrick, yeah. um, you obviously came, came up against them last week, uh, narrowly lost out. What do you think you guys will be, uh, need to do differently this, this time around? And what makes it so difficult to, to score against the Sundowns? Um, I think last time we played them, we started very slow. Um, the first half, we were not there and we made a uh, lot of mistakes. And during the week, we were working hard to make sure that we go into the final with fresh minds and to make sure that we start the game perfect and so that we can be able to match them. And I think it's going to be a very exciting final for the team also and for the people also. What makes it so difficult to score against the Sunday? I don't know. They've conceded <laughs> goals. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We shall see on weekend, though. What's going to happen? Yeah. Uh, again, there's a there's a notion that says you guys, as the other 15 teams in the PSL, you give too much respect to Sundowns, and you only started playing on the second half of the game when you played against them. How how much do you make of that? Um, I wouldn't say um, all of the teams. I think um, we're not giving them respect. Um, we do what we gotta do in the fall and we follow the coach's instruction and sometimes it doesn't work sometimes it works but also we have an opportunity to play them again and also have an opportunity to prove so we'll see what happens on the weekend on a personal level like um lives obviously changed in the past three four months yet pirates probably more recognized um is there a more pressure on your shoulders now um, being in the spotlight more than when you were at Super Sport or playing in Portugal? No, not at all because we this is the team sport. I think we all do well. In order for me to do well, I need my teammates. So I can't feel pressure or I can't be feeling big at the moment because there's nothing I've done for the team. So also it's a great opportunity for me to play in my first final with Orlando Pirates and I'm very happy and will work hard and try to improve also. It's obviously an opportunity for you also to get silverware so early on in your stay at, at the club and, and in the PSL, uh, your first piece of silverware. How important or how much would it mean to you to, to lift that trophy on Saturday? Um, not only for me, but uh, for the Orlando Pirates family and also for our fans. We've been disappointing them for quite a um, few uh, few weeks and we want to uh, make them happy, especially this weekend. And we want to do our best and we want to perform very well. And it will be great for me also as well and for my family. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.